Hey guys, J Dog Gaming here, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to win on MW Plays Challenge. Um, this is today's daily challenge, so let's get into it. So first, we're gonna put down a dart monkey. And then we're also gonna, like, see. He has no upgrades that you can get for him. But he can solo it out for a while here. And we wanna put him, all the dart monkeys we can get in the best places because you don't get that many towers. And these are the restrictions for the ace, and these are the restrictions for the helicopter. Alright, let's get another dart monkey going in. Um, probably right there. Um, up there. And another one down here. And then they can solo it out for a while. But we want to get that, um, what's it called? I, nope, not this. We want to get the monkey helicopter up, um, as soon as we can so we could get, um, camo detection. Alright. See, they have a time slow down ability, but why would, they don't have a time speed up ability. I wish you could just make the rounds go by even quicker. Alright. We can get the plane up. There's no point in doing that right now. Alright. So 600 more dollars. Come on, monkeys. Alright. I keep saying that, it's probably really annoying. Um, yeah, it's a pretty funny story actually, while we're waiting to get the money. Um, I know I wasn't uploading, <laughs> and I made a video called Hi, and said I was going to upload more videos, and then I never uploaded. So, um, yeah, sorry about that. Nothing else to say, just got really lazy. But, um, I'm going to try to do more of these daily challenge videos. Tell me if you want to do any more because they are pretty easy content to make. Except for when the daily challenges start getting hard. And, um, it's a way I can upload videos. So we're going to have to control the helicopter around. Have him pop the balloons. Because we need to get the... Um, other upgrade before pursuit. Oops, wrong button. The faster darts doesn't really matter. We probably want quad darts at this point. I like moving the helicopter around. But we can leave him right there. And he actually has some pretty good popping power. So now that, not that many balloons will get by there. So get IFR so we can pop camos. That's pretty much our only source of camos. We, we also need to get the fighter plane up before the, um, what's it called? The lead balloons. Oops. So as soon as we can get him up, we're going to get him up too. Alright, a few more balloons, come on. And we want to put him right about there. And you can see he has a path that goes around a good part of the map, and we need these exploding pineapples. Actually, hold on. Sorry about this. I meant to say right there. And then we can have it on whatever he wants because there's nothing right now. I leave it at that because it has really good map coverage. Now we have spy plane, um, but we wanted the helicopter up because he can actually aim at the balloons, and we had enough money to, so it's better to just get him started up than go for the plane right away. And um, we're gonna get the bomber ace next. There, we got the first camera through. 
but we need to get the bomber ace right now and as you can see since he's on this area so much he drops a lot of bombs so we want him on fig figure infinite and then next I think um one sec I think I want with rapid fire well, it doesn't really matter what you get but it just depends on the angle and since he's at right this spot we're gonna get the sharper darts because it can pop through eight balloons and that's really good for what we're gonna have to deal with and this obviously quad darts because you can get more upgrades on that path not lock in place and then proceeds of, and now we just have to get these um lead balloons popped and we got them all pretty easily right there there we got pursuit now that the helicopter is following it we can let the game sit for a little bit just let the bomber race and helicopter do the work and if you need to you can micro the um, plane so that it will hit the leads like, just put it in the right spot like stuff like that I don't know why I'm doing that it's just fun to see him move around so much but our next big purchase is ground zero and we're gonna need that for a lot of these um, moabs and stuff I'm just having that like that for now so I can hit those ones up there but once I, s I'm gonna switch back to, yeah, right there. Once I need to. Alright. I keep saying that. Oh yeah, my, my monkeys. <laughs> I can't put any down though. I could put that one down? No, you, this one has a lot of restrictions. It makes Insta Monkeys useless pretty much. But not that many people use Insta Monkeys anyways. It's just, like, why not test it out? So, we have to wait for round 40. I don't think we're going to need ground zero before round 40. I didn't need it when I did it, so. Let's see. Bam. And I'm just going to wait until round 40 to see what happens. Okay, as you can see, some leads got by, but the bomber race still managed to pop them. And there's some more. Round 40's coming up quickly. It sneaks up on you sometimes. Alright, there, got it. But you can see how we deal with the ceramics pretty well with the bomber race. So round 40 won't give um, too much trouble, just as long as you have the setup right. There we go. Bam. It manages the balloons pretty well. And anything that gets past the helicopter can just deal with. Alright, here's the Moab. The bomb race is giving us really bad RNG right now. But the good thing about this thing... It, the good thing about this setup is that the balloons come around the path one more time. Because Logs is probably, in my opinion, one of the easiest maps. But we do need to get that to ground zero up by round uh, 60, which will be really easy because there's nothing else to upgrade. So, I just waiting and waiting. That's pretty much all this challenge is. Just get the monkeys in the right spot. And then wait till you can get some upgrades. And the Surrams get popped really easily. You just have to deal with all the balloons that come out of them. There we go. We can get it now. Bam. Ground zero time. Alright. Okay, I need to stop saying that. I'm annoying myself now. In the comments, 
tell me um uh, what you think about th these types of videos i know i said that earlier but i'm curious because i'm trying new things oh yay don't make fun of me i didn't use planes that much um tell me what you think about these types of videos and leave some suggestions there's other videos i can do because um you know I'm kind of bored and I want to make some videos so yeah we would interest you while we wait for round 60 to come and if you're new to the channel don't forget to like and subscribe if you made it this far hopefully I didn't annoy you too much with my voice and my saying the same words over and over again but um, let's see how this turns out we don't need to use it on this because the helicopter has the camera detection, but we're probably going to use it on round 50 just to quickly deal with it, and yeah. And I'm not a master at Balloons Tower Defense 6, I'll admit that, but I'm just showing you how I beat the challenges and um, seeing if it'll work for you guys because I did test this a few times and it seemed to work pretty good, but... Yeah, I'm not a master, so if it doesn't work, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to get some strategies out there. Now this level, the RNG. Okay, come on. We need to get the bombs on the Surams. All right, perfect. Yes, that worked out really good. Sometimes you have to micro that, but that time we didn't. Okay, now we just need to not let these regrows get too out of hand. Come on, bomberies. And remember, we always have this to bail to. Now we just have to deal with this, and it's pretty easy to deal with it. But if you ever need to bail to it, just remember what round is next, and then just um, use it at the right time. Because remember, this round is next, and this round isn't the easiest round, but with the setup, it's pretty easy to beat. You just have to get the good RNG. Alright. Now, bomber race. Yes, perfect. Now 51. Basically the same thing. You just don't have those little dart monkeys helping. And mm, they do an amount of damage. A pretty good amount. But it's not going to be uh, too much harder. Alright. Okay, I did it again. I said alright again. Alright, and then, yep, we're gonna need to use it on this round. Not to worry though, because uh, the ability does come back up pretty quickly. It's just that the regrows, you need this um, ability to deal with them. And yeah, we just wait until we need to use it again, and then round 60 should be pretty easy for you guys. Alright, get that Moab, please. That was a little late, but it's fine. Pretty easy to handle. Oh, pink camo. That's fine. No problem. Moab, pretty easy. Oh, yes. It got hit by, like, all the bombs. Alright, that one needs to get hit some more. Hit that one. Oh, yeah, I hit both. Perfect. Alright, get that Moab, please. Bam. Let's go. We have literally nothing to spend our money on. It's funny. Alright. This sound is pretty easy. Just bam. And the camos aren't that hard to deal with. But you're going to have to leak a few lives if you need to because... It's not a perfect life challenge, but if you want to go for that, you can, because you just have to use the ability at the right time to make it work. Boom. Alright, round 56. We're almost there. Alright, I'm saving it until I need it, which will be pretty soon, actually. I, actually, I don't remember. Oh no, it won't be soon. Sorry, I was thinking the wrong thing. I don't know how I got so confused. Happens, I guess.
Alright, here we go. Pretty easy round here. Alright. Oh, I did it again. I should just have an R right jar or something. No. Halfway through the roundabout. Oh, nice. I hit both. Oh, okay. That's good, actually. Perfect. The mobs are getting hit pretty hard. It's nice. That one, that one's dodging a lot. That one's gonna hit. Let's go. Alright. Come on back up, please. Bomber Alright, we can let that go. Yeah, like I said, we have to leak a few lights, but it's fine. It's not the end of the world. Alright. And this one is really, like, RNG. That one lead balloon could ruin your day if you're at low enough life count. Alright, we have to use it. And then we just have to wait for the ability to get up, and then you won. So... If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe, and tell me if you want to see more videos like this. They're pretty fun to make. Um, this is my first one, but Balloons Tower Defense is fun, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys.